So what's it gonna be? I will find him. Get the cuffs off him. Ooh. Yeah, uncuff him. It's the panic room encounters. Look here, fine boy. We know that you know where your brother is hiding. You just share that information with us. And we'll drop all the charges we have against you. <laughs> you know, guys like you have no respect for the law. Law that suits your pocket. <coughs> Leave me to deal with this fool. Temper, temper. Look here, fine boy. It's guys like you that make our jobs fun. Now, the good thing about this is we get to see a picture of you before and after one year in jail. And I can bet it with you. No amount of plastic surgery would stop or change the beat down you would get to beat your fine face. Now, trust us. We will deliver you to your enemies in jail. <laughs> uh, you know, you, you, you guys you, you guys are just like two dogs, you know, perceiving each other's asses for direction. But the truth is, both of you, your asses smell alike. Um, yeah, I actually meant your asses. Look, young man. I only stopped my colleague here from bashing your head in because I thought you were going to be smart and cooperate with us. But you see, I'm running out of patience. So I'm going to ask you for one last time. Where is Kwame? Let me clear go. <laughs> you have no evidence against him. I give you five minutes to release him. Else, I'll sue you, your department, and you guys will end up as dead men in motion. Received your your cheap perfumes you know, when I came here. You know that, that's actually why <laughs> to put on weight to come. Guy moving before he's pressed on the hair for us, fat fool. 